grass because it, it's dark I'm in here. Dark. Can you actually I, see it's us? It's like when the TV flashes a bit, I can kind of see you. You love that rustic. I'm rustic. drinking a drink straight because the, the monsters are empty. Straight. And I'm off while I don't want to use What's up? Why one? Hi! Oh, ah, my leg! Hi! <laughs> Don't focus on this Such video. a pretty shot though. <laughs> <laughs> what? It's so pretty. No, no! <laughs> Vacation and lust to something that's very spiritual and almost tantric. And um, while the lover's card typically refers to a romantic tie, it can also represent a close friendship or family relationship where love, respect and compassion flow. Um, it symbolizes open communication and raw honesty. And um, that both people are willing to be in the most vulnerable states and have learned to open their hearts to one another and share their truest feelings. This card represents getting clear about your values and beliefs. And um, having gone through the indoctrination of the Hierophant? How do you say that word? Did I get that card earlier or did you? Oh, I got that. That was the holy card. Yeah. That's not how you say it though. You're now ready to establish your belief system and decide what it is, what is and what is not essential to you. Time to go into the big void world and make choices for yourself, staying true to who you are and being authentic and genuine in all your endeavours. At its heart, the lover's card is about choice. The choice about who you want to be with in this lifetime, how you connect with others and on what level and about what you 